Hi, my YouTube family. How are we doing today? Today I will be vlogging today. I will be out and I am going to vlog some of my activity today. I will be vlogging um, some of my activity today. Not all. I was I was supposed to go to lunch with some friends today. I'm going to see if I can vlog them a little bit before we start dinner. Dinner? I mean lunch? <sighs> I think I know what place I want to eat at, but I can't think of the name. I have to um, remember what the name was. So how are we doing this beautiful day? It looks really lovely outside. I hope everyone is having a gorgeous day today. Mm -mm -mm. So how did you guys, no, I'm sorry. How did you guys, what did you think about me? If you have seen it, my video for how I season my beef frank and my chuck roast tell me what you think about it and um have you tried it let me know i am going to um do another um dish i have to remember what all the ingredients are because i have not made i don't even know if i'm is i'm not going to be putting no shrimp in it because of my daughter but I will put everything else in it, like sausage, um, some what, chicken, and maybe something else to substitute for the seafood part of it. It's, it's, it's supposed to be a seafood gumbo, but it's not. It's probably just going to be a chicken gumbo because I can't do the um, seafood for my daughter. That would be great. But she's going away for the weekend. Is it this weekend? Yeah. So I will be able to... Oh, maybe I'll do it then. Maybe I'll do a seafood dish um, this weekend because she's going to be gone. She's going to spend the weekend with her, her best friend because she, she noticed that she hadn't um, spent time over there with her. So she's going to be gone for the weekend. So I probably could do it Friday. Hmm. Would be great. Yep. I could do it Friday. So I'm heading into the office. Actually, I want to go to our sales meeting today to see how that goes. Oh, look how beautiful that sun is in the clouds. I will flip you guys, but I'm driving, so it's not going to work. I have a busy week this weekend. I have a wedding to go to this weekend. Next weekend, I have another wedding to go to. And the third Saturday, I have a graduation to go to. So I have a very busy Saturdays this month. So that means that one day out of the week, I'm going to have to have a rest day. I mean, where I don't get out of bed or do anything. Sunday is my rest day, but I get up to go to church, interact, go out and have dinner. Sorry, guys. We got interrupted there for a brief moment. So I have a very busy... I don't even know where I left off that because I was um, really surprised that I got cut off there. Um, man, because it was so early. Like, who's calling me this early in the morning? Yeah, so ooh, I have to do some shopping. Um, formal. I have to go out and buy a formal gown for this wedding. I don't even know where to shop at here in Jacksonville for formal wedding gowns. I mean, I know I've been here for a minute and people are used to their stores here. I'm not. You know, I've lived in Miami and there's so many different stores to shop at. So many that I just when I have to buy something, I really don't know 
what to do because especially I want to buy something good and nice and quality. You know, because when I buy dresses, I basically know if I order offline, but jeans, I'd be wanting to try them on. I, I always want to try them on, but <sighs> I'm scared that if I order a pair of jeans, it won't fit right. So I'm going to try on a formal thing. So I'm going to a different office. And this office that I'm going to now is light for light. It's the only way to get there. I got to do all Jacksonville street lights. I might not hang there all day because I might go to this sales meeting. I'm going to go in the office and see what is up. To see what's going on. Mm, I need to find a lawn guy. I really need to get somebody to do this yard for us. At least get us on the right track to see. Mm. Ooh, so let's see how this going to work out. I hope everyone is subscribing to my channel. Mm -hmm. Watching all my videos. Sorry, my mind is like zoning out. Like, it's zoning. I'll talk more later when I get to where I'm going. You know, I was just thinking that I might put a couple of keto meals up. I'm not, I don't do keto, but if there is someone that I know someone, someone is someone, but I know someone that does keto and maybe I can do some recipes for everyone who does keto. You know, maybe it's something new that you're not doing that I could provide for you and you might like it. So I will put up a couple of keto recipes up um, on my channel just so if you guys who are doing keto, you know, maybe you, maybe I might put up something that you haven't tried yet because I know there are plenty of keto recipes out there um, that everyone is doing. I try keto, but keto is not for me because... I don't know because I'm not really a pasta fan. Um, and my potato, yeah, mm, it depends on the dish that I'm making. Like when I made my beef stew, you know, that's that's potatoes. Um, I love my tomatoes. I love um, what else? It's not keto friendly. Um. Sweets, yeah, I love my sweets. I always have to have a dessert after my sweets. You know, I tried the keto, I don't know. I haven't tried the keto um, desserts or anything, so I don't even know if I even like the keto desserts, so I'm not gonna say that. But I do love desserts um, after my meal. I'd be looking for something sweet, whether it's a, a small little candy bar, um, not not a chocolate fan, but I like candy. So, I don't know. I'll try to give it a shot. And look and see um, what keto stuff that I used to try. I'll put up, you know, because me and my daughter tried it. And we was like, no. Because there were certain things. Like, my daughter loves bread. And I heard that. Her, I mean, you got to go through a lot of keto bread to find the right bread. And... I don't know. I don't think she's willing to do that. So we tried it and there was something that we just love. And bread is her number one thing. She loves her bread. So I will put up some keto stuff um, for you guys, meals. And hopefully it's something that, you know, someone loves and they will use it in one of their recipes. Or it might be something, you know, if I put it up there. Oh, I already do that already. Fine. That's good, too. But you never know. So I would try that. 
to see. Um, never know. Somebody might try the keto stuff. Like when I did my um, garlic spread, you know, one of my subscribers told me that, you know, that was keto friendly for her. She could do it. You know what I'm saying? She, could use, she probably used the keto bread, so that worked for her. All right, I'm at my first destination. It's my exit office back there that I am heading to right now um, for a meeting. I'm gonna go. I haven't been to one of these meetings in a couple of years. I can say that. So I'm gonna go ahead inside. This is one of um, many of many vlogs that was gonna happen today. So I'm gonna go inside. Hopefully, I can get a little vlog inside with the girls and the guys too. Okay, so I will see you guys inside. Oh, let me tell you, it's hot out here. You see that sun? I'm about to do like this because I feel it on my forehead. And I can't take the sun like that. So, oh, it's super hot out here. I don't see that many cars out here. I know I'm a little bit early, but I like to be early because I need to know what's going on. I might not stay. You never know. So I'm gonna turn you guys around. This is my exit office here that I am heading inside. Let's see what's going on. Made it inside safely. Yay. See? That's my broker, Sonny, back there. This is my Mandarin office. Here. I don't know, they got the C space out, but I don't know. I'll see once everybody gets here. Check in a little bit. Hi. So that was a long um, meeting. I learned a lot being that I was not doing it for a while. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a couple of the meetings that they have just to refresh my memory on a couple of new rules that the real estate has now have out there, especially since COVID and we was all shut down for a while. So I'm gonna do a couple of um, training classes again. I love my real estate firm, Exit Real Estate Gallery, because they have so many coaches out there for you. There's no way you can fail. The only way you can fail is you. Yeah, so I'm going to do um, a couple of guys. And I'm getting ready to go have lunch with um, a church member right now. We're going to have lunch together. Yay. Look like the weather has changed since I've been in the meeting. It's not sunny. It's cloudy. Hmm, there's no wind blowing. Yeah. My daughter asked me, say, you love repeating yourself, don't you? For me, I guess that's the way it has to be. I'm driving and I just hit my leg. <laughs> I even left time to go um, with my leg. How about that? I need to get over. I love husband's pickup truck. Now this car won't get over. <sighs> there was a whole bunch of new faces in there that I did not know. Well, I knew the brokers, of course. And I knew the support team. Um, I knew one agent that was there. It was so many new people. That's good. They all ask questions, though. The new people. Some things I already knew that they touched topic on. He just throw his cigarette out there. Hope it wasn't lit. I hope that it wasn't lit. Oh, what? I just ran over. Oh. Mm, and he 
he's trying to go faster than me. Let me punch it a little bit more. Because he's seriously trying to go faster than me. Knowing he's not going to go that fast. I don't know why people get in front of you and then they don't even go fast like you. They cut you off and then they go two miles an hour. And I don't understand it. It's like so far since I've been talking with you doing these little vlogs, I'm in my truck. Mm -hmm. I'm probably gonna do more vlogging. Oh, we need to get over. I like doing vlogging. I like talking to you. Now that I'm more, now that I'm comfortable, excuse me, of doing my YouTube channel, I need to come up with a name for y'all. I always get on here and say, hi, my YouTube family. But I need to have a name for you guys. I mean, what would you guys want me to call you know, when I get on here, what do you guys want to be called? Just YouTube family? I mean, how do you guys feel about me calling you YouTube family? I mean, it's, I feel like I want to call you guys something more than just YouTube. Because I know I do YouTube videos but I want to have a name for y'all when I get on here. So I feel like I'm talking more personally to you, you know? So any suggestions, let me know. And the one that's more, sorry. Wow, this person was really in a hurry. Okay. You know, and I'll pick one, I'll decide, I'll announce the names, a couple of them, and then you tell me how does it work. You know, you write, you say it in my comments down below, and then I will, you know, intro it in the beginning. So you guys um, tell me which one fits better. Okay? Works. Or you can um, tell me... If you don't want to say it on YouTube, you can say it in one of my on on a, one of my other social media accounts that's linked down in my bio, and let me know, and then I will say it on my YouTube channel. Then everyone could chime in and say which one sounds better. You might choose one from me, and then I might say one. You're like, oh, Christine, I think I like that one better. <laughs> you never know. It was a car that was ahead of me. He was so in a hurry that he drove around on the media to go around this truck to go so fast and then he's right up here caught up in traffic. I don't understand it. People wanna be in a such of a hurry to get nowhere. do have patience to drive. I drive and sometimes you know you get them people that's in the slow lane, I mean the fast lane that is going, now if they going over the speed and I'm looking at my speed and I'm doing what I'm supposed to do, I don't even worry about it because I know they're not slowing me down. But if you get them ones that be going 10 miles under, I just sit there and wait patiently. Then the next thing you know, they move over because you know why? They get tired of looking in a rearview mirror at you in your back. They're doing that constantly like that. You know, just say, let me get over. Let this person go by. And when they go, I just say, thank you. And then just move on on. My merry way. That's how you have to do it. Wow. Am 
might rain today. I mean, these it's too cloudy. Uh-oh. Let me tell y'all something right now. That is not sleep. That's hungry. I am getting hungry. My body yarns when it's hungry. And the first thing it wants to do is go to sleep. So if you see me yarning, even when I'm doing a mukbang, that's because I'm so hungry that I it's not in my system yet. And I'm eating. I don't eat fast. I eat very slow. <laughs> my daughter and my husband sometimes be like, Especially when me and my girls go out to eat. I'll be the last one to finish. they waiting on me. I try. To them, they say, Mom, you're not going fast. I say, I am eating fast. They say, Josephine say, no, you're not. <laughs> Every single time she say, no, you're not. I say, but I am. She said, no, you're not. And don't let her go to a burger joint and get me a burger. And the fry, if the fries are good, I be tearing them fries up. And she say, stop eating them fries, excuse me. I say, she say, mama, you know you're going to get full. Stop eating those fries. Eat the burger. Eat the burger. I mean, oh my God, but the burgers, the fries be so, I don't like all fries. I love McDonald's fries. McDonald's fries are on point. Now, I love, um, who else fries I love? Um... Oh my God, I hope I can think of their names. Oh, I need to hurry up and get something to eat. Um, can't think of their names, but the name of the place. But I love their fries too. Mm, I wish I could think of their names, but I'm not gonna be able to do it. There's only two places, a lot of people don't like their fries. I mean, mm -mm. I know how fries are made, so it's not like, but I don't know. I know how they made, you know, they make them like mashed potatoes and then they got this machine to shape them like french fries. Then you eat them, that's why they be so mushy. But I usually, um, I like to, when I'm home, I do homemade fries. I take my time and cut, peel my potatoes, slice them up, you know, and rinse them off, let them dry out. And I love my homemade fries. That way I could do them the size I want, how long I want, how, you know, big I want. And my daughter loved to make a sandwich out of them. She'd get in because some of the mayonnaise and the bread and she tear them french fries up. Yeah, it's nothing like home fries when you don't feel like getting the other, um, the fries from the restaurant or fi fries from a fast food place. You tend to make your own. I love making my own. See, that's why I can't do keto. Mm -mm. Cause if I get some fries, mm -mm, I'm gonna wanna make me some home. I mean, if I get some potatoes, I'm gonna wanna do me some homemade fries with them. So, nope. So I can't do keto for that reason. And we always, do. when I have potatoes left over, when I know I'm not gonna use them for the rest of the week, Instead of letting them go bad, I'll just go ahead on and um, make french fries out of them. And we make sandwiches. I'm almost there meeting my church member for lunch. I'll see if I can um, vlog them right quick. It would be great. YouTube family so I made it home I <sighs> they didn't want to vlog right now she does YouTube too but she just wanted to be out for a little bit we just had lunch together she also YouTube too so yeah sometimes I have to catch myself when I do a double speak on something so we had an interesting conversation um, together she brought her um, friend with her too. So we did have a long conversation uh, about some topics that, you know, I don't know if I can talk about it with here on my channel. Maybe she will talk about it on her channel. So I'm tired. I've been out all morning. So I am 
up and chill, get relaxed, and enjoy my relaxation for the rest of the day. So I'm gonna end my vlog here, home. Whew. I mean, we went to um, this restaurant called Cheddar's. I love their sweet glazed croissants. You know, you, they give you two complimentary, but I always ask for two more. <laughs> uh, and I always end up, you always get a salad and a piece of beef um, and eat it, or a salad, Did I, or a salad or a burger. I always get a salad. I don't know, it's most time I go to restaurants, I always get some type of vegetable. I think that helps me get my digestive system because my digestive system starts fast. I start burping real quick within, within my meals, which is great. I like that eh, when I do that. So YouTube family, I'm tired. I'm not going to hold you guys up much longer. I'm just going to say, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell. So you guys will be notified every time I put up a video and follow me on all my social media accounts down in my bio. So y'all have a safe, blessed, and a wonderful day. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.